Okay, bye. I bet you that drug just fucks me up. I bet it does. And I get all groggy, and then this dude... I don't- you think I wanna fucking go to sleep around this guy? This thing? I don't I yet have a racist name for him, because I'm still trying to work it out? <sighs> okay, I'm- I- you've been doing that also the whole time? Just like, Frozener, Frozener, what do I got? What do I got here? <laughs> what do I got? Yeah. And you want to make sure that it's pretty far from a real yep, one. Yep, yep, So that yep. we don't accidentally have another, uh, uh what is it, Sonic Unleashed scenario no, here. No, no, no. Uh, Icebox is not gonna cut it. <laughs> oh, man. I think we might have to take the pill. Oh. Uh, we'll talk to Tony a little bit. Well, there's no new topics. Hey, what is it? Oh, arrival time? I, yeah, he just said, shut the fuck up, we'll get there. Why not? Yeah. Be honest, much for, uh, why don't you watch the news again? Oh, maybe we'll get some fake TV with David Hayter on it. I absolutely adore fake TV and, and stuff like this. There was a lot of that in Metal Gear 4, though. Hey, Karen, what up? I'm, I'm, I'm gonna come talk to you soon. Oh。ウォッス。宇宙開発における宇宙環境の影響により人体への様々な障害が起こっています。宇宙開発における宇宙環境の影響により人体への様々な障害が起こっています。宇宙開発における宇宙環境の影響により人体への様々な障害が起こ
Kojima is enabling us. I'm sorry. Oh, man. All right. I must look like shit, right? All right. All right. Pass out. <sighs> what, what, what else? We're stuck in this hell. What else? Space is boring. Ask him more about Frozies. About Freezy Pops. Yeah, they hate being discriminated against. If anything else, we're the superior ones. Oh, that's cool. Get a little airflow. I mean, you'd need it. Yeah. Mm. Why don't you just stare out into space and think about where, how you've gotten here? How about the decisions you've made in your yeah. life? We'll be able to see beyond soon. Can I press? Yeah, the press presses press his arm. Look at his arm. That sucks. Oh, really? Is that the case? Why? I imagine there's some form of healing thing. Do you think these buttons matter? No. They're all the same. Uh-huh. What about that bottom button? The escape button that blows the airlock. Look at his number. Look at his... Just stare at his number like an asshole. Yeah. What's your number, dickhead? I don't think we get it. Alright, let's go back over this. Job. Must be a pretty busy guy. Beyond. Beyond. 30th birthday. Alright, he did Frozen Roots again. Alright, and arrival time, he just tells you to fuck yourself. <sighs> You've shown all these things. Shit, you mind handing that? I can skip through these things crazy fast. Because I'm an asshole. Alright. Oh, that's a warm controller. Oh, D-pad! Oh! Go God damn it! <laughs> Where was that? It was on his head. You to the right. To the right of his head. To the right of his head. Because I tapped on his head and that's what I got. Yeah. Cheers. Oh, the sweat's gone. Look at that. Yeah. That's the pills. Hey, thanks, Tony. You're my buddy. Hey, when I say some egregious shit later, can you, like, vouch for me? And I'll be like, look, Tony's my friend! What's the condition of your organs? I smoke? I'll vouch for you. Why does this music sound like a final boss is going to happen? Mm. You need a medical exam for space. Oh, Tony looks very different in this. Yeah, with his head turned. Yeah. He's got those bad guy thin jaw, um, cheeks. Look how wide that spaceship is. Look at that leg room. What a waste of space. No, because seriously, when you travel in spaceships, every mo every part of it is compacted. Yeah, but now now it's luxury space. Oh, so it's uh, Lance Bass space. Yeah. Yeah, got got it. Yeah. Oh. Cool. So we started off in an area that was technically familiar, mm -hmm. only to immediately go to somewhere totally alien. That's true. That's true. We started in the Snatcher, like, you know, environment, and then took off. I think it is extraordinarily vital for people who live in space, uh, like future colonists, like, say, the people in Gundam. Mm -hmm. I think a huge part of the problem is that many of those colonies cannot see Earth from the colony because they're inward facing. And the fact that they don't see it. There needs to, they're, like,. Earth. I have a weirdly like strong romantic attachment to the Earth as humanity's home. Yeah. And I find like the idea of living out in, in the space and being so far from Earth that you don't even recognize it as the cradle of humanity to be like tragic. Okay, but what about the ones where they go, we always see it and it you taunts go us go. and we can't... Good! Good! Fuck go you, you fucking space <laughs> call it We can't get there so it oh, makes them feel go bad go. because they can't get there. Earth is the shit! <laughs> right? 
That's the thing, is if you can't see the it... The Titans are just <laughs> protecting <laughs> Earth! How <laughs> dare you! Alright, alright. The I AU! <laughs> I gotta calm down for a second. <laughs> I gotta calm down. <laughs> this looks suspiciously like a Tokyo airport. BCP. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I think I think whether you're, you're damned if you do, you're damned if you don't. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I think the solution is to bring everybody to Earth for a little bit as a class trip. Well, unless you're in Cowboy Bebop, in which Earth is ruined. Well, yeah. <laughs> or uh, Type A, in which Earth is gone. Yeah. Oh look, Karen's on the news. There she is. Look at the news. What's the chick from um, Deus Ex again? Oh, Eliza Kassan. There you go. Oh man, this is like very classic, like PlayStation era, like music sounding. Absolutely. Like that. That's a little boing, boing, that, boing, that thing. Boing, boing. It reminds me of like tracks from like Xenogears mm -hmm. and like uh, yep. RPG RPG town music. Absolutely. It's a space plane pilot. Oh, active amphibians can go back and forth no problem, because their bodies get used to it. Look at all these flights. Space planes. Dude, a, real green. a space plane delay on the runway? I oh, know. man. I know. That may be the most important technological thing they've talked about in this so far. Bread plants to photosynthesize light. Artificial light. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's near self-sustaining. That's crazy. Plants are crazy. They're gonna have to overthrow us one day. Uh, it's already happening. It's happening. Happening. It's happening. Alright, let's go. Second floor. Is that an option? Door. Oh! 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 The wait, 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 hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Can I- I can't read that again, can I? Okay, the soles of your shoes stick to the carpet as you go along. So you walk a little funny. The floors are super sticky to counteract that the edge of the colony doesn't have a strong gravity. That's super interesting is, and cool. Is that the explanation in Gundam? Because in Gundam, people walk around normally, but then they're, they're able to immediately jump up and float. No, in Gundam, I think it's because the colony's spinning fast enough to hold you down. I'm not talking about the colony. I'm talking about when they're on their ships. Uh, when they're on their ships, they're normally walking around, and then they grab the pole. And then the, and then the pole and then, and they shoots shoot, them around. Like, why is gravity it. turning on and off at random? They get It's a button on the ship. It's a button on the ship. No, but it's there are people walking by while other people are zooming by with the thing. Yeah. It must be because the floor is sticky. You gotta read Gundam. Sticky floor. You gotta read Gundam Sentinel, where they where they go into the science of that shit. Uh, yeah, this still looks like a modern today airport. Okay. Move to the BCP. BCP. Okay, I, what I have what I haven't really learned and internalized yet is that pressing the back button while nothing's happening uh -huh. gives you the BCP. back out. Hey, the there's the there's want. the fancy robots. Oh man, I want to be a okay. police knot. Okay. How big is beyond? A million people? No, but I mean, how physically large yeah, is the I, tube? We'll, we'll have to see. Because you can't see the tube on the ceiling. That's true. Unless that's all fake screen. It could be fake screen. Like I have an internal cylinder that's just a fake ass sky. Kind of pathetic. Wow. These new guys with their robot suits. What a bunch of chodes. I see cars haven't changed at all. Yeah, they don't look. Those are just police cars. <laughs> and uh, what about the what about the piece of pizza? That looks like the entrance. Let's go. Let's go inside. Oh, now you're getting it. Man, who's that tall glass of fine drinking water on the left? Hey, that, those green pants got my attention. Hello. What's going on with you? You come here often? Undercover. Mm. Oh, it's a 
map. All right. Hey, Ed. Yeah, you can talk to him. Just put your hand on her face and just push oh, yeah, her. Yeah, exactly. Away. I'm here to do space shit. I don't shit. need this bullshit. I'm here for real things. I already got my eye on something in this space colony. Let me tell you the news about that. <laughs> This is terrible. That was, that was really bad. It's pretty bad, huh? Please, please put your fingers to your glasses and correct them while the reflection shines off. How is the crime? What is colony crime like? Well, Narc seems totally out of control. <laughs> But how bad do we treat it when we see somebody trip ball tripping balls on Narc? If if one out of three people is tripping balls on Narc, at all times, you kind of just kind of let it ride. Yeah, it's like oh, he's narking right now. I don't know if I should narc on him. Why <laughs> you such a narc, Narc? No, wait, what? Am I the? Have, just have a narc, bro. Oh, okay. Hi, I snitched. What? You narc what? <laughs> you narc the narc! People that are high on narc would not be able to navigate this <laughs> at all. Ah, uh, shit. <coughs> um, time's change. Alright. Okay. Old cops. Ah, I see. What is the advanced police? Better than those basic bitch police. Uh-huh. Elite unit? Is that the actual name? Yes, the BBP. The, yeah, the Emps and Frozeners. Okay. Oh, so it's the Suits mm, and Frozeners, so it's... Go ahead. Yeah, they are, in fact, super police. Yes, they are. <laughs> hey. Okay, okay. Right. Yeah, those things are lame. I mean, look, I I'll take I'll take tank police, I'll take mobile armor divisions, I'll take whatever you got for me, man. That's fine. See, the main thing about the Frozeners is that, like, they don't have parents, right? They're just kind of... Well, they're also explicitly 100% controlled by the government. <laughs> yeah. Just, just, can I please see Ed Brown? I know please? he's around. Yes, I'm here to see Ed Brown. Junkyard? What? Oh. Well, that's... Oh, they, oh, they, they call it the junkyard. I see. A vice. How does the BS work? Does it, da, da, da. Maybe he handles just about everything they used to do. Huh. Why do they still call it vice? Oh man, space vice. The K? Why is everybody so weird in this police station? Is it because of space? They're using terms for shit that's it's going a little too going too quick. We gotta keep quick, up. Quick, show mo just photo. Hey. <laughs> you ever seen this guy? Whenever you panic and don't know what to do, show a picture of Hojo. See if that gets the conversation juicing. What? Why are you showing me this? Alright, how do you feel about Lorraine, though? You see this? <laughs> you see this? <laughs> you see this? This is my old one. Okay, I'm gonna tell you what. You know this, though. Yeah, it's a leaf. Oh, wait, you picked the police knot. Yeah. Oh, I thought you showed the leaf. Right? Anti-aging ops. No, I'm a famous freak. Don't you know me? Wow, you talking shit? About the knots? Gonna get hit. Alright, let's just let's, let's just, just get out of here. Why is that? Dickhead. What a dickhead. Uh, wow. Ed's in a bad place, huh? Ed's just a f okay, well you should probably talk to the dame. Yeah, I don't really want to. Oh! Okay. That makes sense. Okay, I was reading that font as Eloman. <laughs> I was like, so that was a bit of a weird one. But you know what? How about that? Wait, a call girl wouldn't proposition you inside a police station. Unless you're in space. Yeah, no, but the whole point of a call girl is that you call them. 
Unless you're on NARC. A call girl is not a streetwalker. Like... Unless you're on space, NARC. See, it shows Kojima doesn't know. He needed to do more research after this game was done. Well, the funny part is that the, the person we ignored was the most ignorable person. Yep. We were correct. All right, let's go. To oh, to fight. Hey, I can just walk in here, right? I showed you my fake badge. Jeez. Ow. Why you gotta shit on my buddy? Oh, man. So here's what I want from Ed. Balding old black guy. I want Ed to be a head in a jar. Ugh. No, I want I want Parasite Eve. You want just Daniel Brown too? Yeah. Look at is that Meryl? That's Meryl Silverberg. By the way, that's literally Meryl. Really? What? I don't get it. That's a tall lady. We'll get what about there. this loser here? This Naruto episode one character before oh you got the headband? God. Oh my god, that is... Oh, oh. That's on point. Fuck you, that's on point. Naruto and Meryl. <sighs> you may not have my hamburgers. You may not. There's a little Godzilla it. doll in the middle there. You see that? Oh, man, I see it. I see it. I really hope Ed is making little furniture in that desk back there. Oh. F <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, man. King of Monsters final series. Noburo Sakai. All right. Mathers from Zero All right, G. so we got nerds. We got nerds down in Oh, Vice. making these in Zero G keeps it easier because, oh, I bet putting a screen protector on in space is actually a lot easier. All right, all right. This is either going to be the best or the worst, but I want him to be a down and out, tired old beat cop that's going to find his Wait, way through the stop mission. Talking for a second. He's asleep. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna, I want him to find his way through the mission that we have him go on one last time before Mendoza takes him out. Oh, boy. I can't make out his face. That's it, all right. Wake up, you old geezer. You, Ed, you bum. You son of a bitch. Wake the fuck up, you old man, you bastard. Once upon a time, you were natural police. Hey, Ed, what up? Oh, he's old. God damn it. I can't believe he's asleep in here. Fucking Ed. Ed. That dude at the front was right. This is an embarrassment. He was super right. That you didn't do over the last four years. I guess this one makes a bit more sense, because he's been up in space, and, and you've got cosmophobia, so you wouldn't go out to see him. But you would have called. No. Too awkward. Then she got blown up and killed. Oh, I guess... I guess you're just gonna not help them. Come on. Show me a picture of your kids. Show me the little furniture you've been building. Come on. Damn! See? Yeah. So how about you show everyone that you're still real police? Exactly. Call yourself a junker. That's cool. Cooler people have done the same. Oh man, I'm old now. I've given up. All I have now is my family and, and my, my mortgage, mortgage and my dog and my old car that I'm just about to pay off. <laughs> uh, okay, it's Becker's doing cool ass shit. 
この汚い地下で机にしがみついているのです。So、that's it. You're just gonna hang out here until they put your body on a pool table. わかった。それじゃ。デカ長、デカ長がやらないなら、私が手伝うわ。メリルがやるって言うなら、僕もその話を。It's literally Meryl. バカなこと言うな。<laughs> That's she has a foxhound tattoo. Yes, she does. Dude, what? This is the weirdest <gasps> yeah. one of them all. Uh, yeah, this is the absolute most bizarre one ever. You want to talk about your send ups? Back in Snatcher, it was the、uh, the Metal Gear. Yeah. Right? And here you fucking get a character that apparently used to be part of Foxhound. Like, I bet through some creative math you can make the, the goddamn years work up. They cannot work up in any way, shape, or form. Yeah. She's in space! Creative math. She's in space! Well, I don't know if you remember, but Sunny was working on spaceship stuff in Metal Gear Rising. Then where's her Rat Patrol tattoo? And she just, and he just started talking about anti aging stuff. So maybe after the marriage to Johnny fell through, because God damn, I hope it falls through. She's like, I'm gonna go to be a space cop. Because of that diarrhea ass. That's an awkward character trait for your husband. I still can't believe that happened. Just literally Meryl Silverberg. Yo! No! No! What? What the fuck? No! No! What are you? This came out before Metal Gear Solid! So, Meryl, this game exists before Metal Gear Solid. Okay, okay. This game exists okay,、right. after Metal Gear. Alright, 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 alright. And Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake. So, Metal Gear 2 is Zanzibar Land, yeah? What the right? fuck? Right, that's Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake is Zanzibar Land, not Metal Gear 1. Metal Gear 1 is Outer Heaven. Yeah, Metal Gear 1 is、yes. Outer Heaven. Metal Gear 2 is、uh, Zanzibar Land. So, in Police Knots. What he's, what Kojima goes is this is a character that hung out with Solid Snake, which we saw a sign for as a bar because that character is a real person in Police Knot. Right. And she was support staff or somebody who went in or was somehow but that, involved but it's, it's, it, like, in Zanzibar Land. But, and then in Metal Gear Solid, he's like, well, nobody played Police Knots. So fuck it, I'm just gonna use that character again. And the time frame in Metal Gear is in the 2000s. Yeah, it's appropriate to this. But they just don't talk about the fact that humanity went to space! Or that it snows in LA! It's, uh, wait, no, did someone tell us? <laughs> someone contact us! It actually might light up! Someone contact us via it something! It might light up! Make it a, just, make a future topic on our subreddit or t w i t t e r current. Just, and then MGS1 happened in the normal world. Shut up. And then everything else was as is. Shut up. But we just ignored the wait, part. Are you telling me that in Metal Gear Solid 4 and Rising, Like Beyond and Frozen Earth and shit was existed、oh. out in space, and we were just not talking so about when them. Did the when did I'm like rubbing my face? <laughs> I can't. When did Snatcher happen? <laughs> before this,、uh, it had Snatcher takes place before the Dr. Madnar and the White Blood. Oh.